Hi guys and welcome to another video by Trim Vegan and Frodo. I'm here with Martin. Yep. Can I call you Mar Marty? Marty, yeah. Marty, there you go. And where are we? Right Mount Kutha. We're at Mount Kutha. We've done a few laps and um, yeah. Yeah, alright. So I've got a 36 cassette on the back of my bike. Then yeah. that, that changed from a 28 and it, it's a significant improvement. Um, I was going up two laps up the mountain, uh, the front side. And I was staying up. To, well, I wasn't cat like totally on on their ass, <laughs> but um, huge improvement. Huge improvement. I definitely liked it. I was happy yeah. with it. So yeah. So you like totally recommend like it's my cheese air, is it? Yeah, yeah. If we're a beginner, definitely go with 36 mm -hmm. on the rear because it's a lot easier on your knees. Uh, because anything else, you find you're straining your knees too much mm -hmm. uh, because there's too much too much of a grind on the in the pedals. So you kind of like, you, you're fighting to sort of move in that sense. Mm -hmm. I actually felt on the bike, actually on the second lap, um, because the first lap I was just sort of figuring out and that, and so I was finding some of the actual uh, inclines were a bit, a little bit too easy on me. Like, oh, seriously? Yeah, so I, I downed a gear a little bit uh -huh. to get more, and that, that found, I found it all right. And also on some of the other inclines, which were even easier still, I downed another gear again. So Okay, yeah. So it, that said, though, obviously I've been doing other sort of stuff, so the fitness is improving. Improving, but, yeah. But still, it's happy that I'm actually going down gears rather than looking for gears to, to go yeah, up to. Yeah, so, yeah, struggling. Yeah. And you're going faster up, hey, Yeah, yeah well. well, I did, the Stravia said that I did um, 23 personal records. Oh, cool. In, in, oh, wow. in those sections or whatever that it counts. That's, so, yeah. that's amazing. Yeah. That's, like, so cool. Yeah. It's really good. Like, yeah. seriously, he's going so fast. Like, the first time we tried it, he was maybe, well, like... the first time I was pushing yeah. up the bike in sections. So mm. I was getting off, pushing the bike and walking up the mountain. Mm. Second lap on that first try, obviously I stayed in my seat and went up the full way, but it was a huge struggle to get there. Yeah. Um, but um, this time I did both both laps, stuck in my seat. I wasn't actually getting up on the pedals or anything like that, like people do when they get mm -hmm. tired or whatever. I was still sitting in the pedals and, and sort of just going yeah. up. And I still was sticking, kind of sticking up with you in the sense mm -hmm. like you weren't halfway down the mountain, you were sort of coming down the mountain and I was just getting up so yeah. to that yeah. point. So yeah, so yeah. that's a huge improvement. Plus, only because we've got a big ride tomorrow, I could have maybe done another another lap up, mm -hmm. but I'm just so yeah. careful not to sort of yeah. waste yourself because just conserve yeah. that energy for tomorrow. Yeah, and what cassette yeah. did you have to begin with? 28, 28, 28, 28 on, the, on the rear. Yeah. I had a fi 52, 52 on the front. And a 36, 52 and a 36, and yeah. so now it's a 52 and a 34 on the front with a, with a uh, 36 in the back and a long cage derailleur. Oh yeah, yeah. So if good. you're buying a bike, the salesman will say, oh, you're fine going up Kutha or whatever, doing about mountain climbs on a 28 and a 52 and yeah. a 36. But no, don't take their advice. <laughs> Get a yeah. bike that has at very least a 32 on the rear, mm -hmm. and obviously a 50 on front and a 34 on the on the, um, on the yeah. front there. And you should be alright for, for yeah. a first time. Yeah. How okay. much did it cost you to swap it over from your old cassette to the new? Um, around about three hundred dollars. So oh, okay. Three hundred dollars. So basically, that include the extra, the uh, the new chain, I included the long cage derailleur, and include the cassette. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, and the and, work on base. Oh well, forty bucks for the labour. So. The, oh okay. Yeah, so, so it didn't so take much. quite that long, like yeah. in terms Well, it of took hour. the whole took the whole day. So I dropped okay. it off the day before, only because I could only drop it off mm -hmm. at lunchtime. But they sort of yeah. worked on it the whole day because they had other work. So maybe they could have done it in half a day, but okay. because they had other work on. But oh. I got it today, so I'm happy. So, oh, yeah. that's very cool. Yeah, yeah. And very good to consider. Yeah. To consider that if you're a starter. Yep. And because uh, it's a carbon, obviously uh, carbon fibre frame, I do recommend obviously if you need obviously storage, you can't get a pannier rack because it doesn't work. It's too much weight for the frame. Yeah, like I do. See. Yeah. So only an aluminium frame you could do that. Yeah. Whereas I got a Dyna pack. So basically, it hooks on the. Uh, that there under the seat, so and a little clip in, so you press that button and it detaches. So you can oh, actually yeah. walk off the bag, and so just leave that uh -huh. on, the, on the bike. Yeah. So that's good, and it has a little sort of rain cover if you can take out and put over yeah. it. But mm -hmm. otherwise, it's good. You can't store a huge amount in it, but you know, it's good if you commit yeah. to work. Yeah. Yeah, how much was that? Did you get online? $150 at the bike store. Bike store? But they ordered it in. Okay. So, yeah. Oh, so but you don't load it up with anything because obviously the carbon fiber can't yeah. take the weight but it, it does yeah. it's good enough for just you know handy handy it's handy for storage yeah. so yeah and like your like puncture kit and all that is yeah there. exactly well, i could put the puncture kit you know well i can't only put it in there because that's there now but i could put the, uh, put the pump there because it has a little bit oh, yeah. there but otherwise yeah, yeah lock uh, puncture kit and a little bit of uh, clothes or whatever oh, yeah. so you don't lose your <laughs> yeah. lock <laughs> yeah exactly because I put my lock there last time and it fell yeah. off so yeah well, I lost okay. it yeah. okay cool well thanks for that alright go vegan okay. <laughs> go vegan see ya